Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be checking out this Snow Plowing Simulator Prologue. Now, I've played the demo of this game. And I gotta say, uh, the demo was a little... Mm, mm, not great, it was a little boring. Um, it's kind of the way they end it. So, let's hop into here. And uh, let's see what they have changed. So just remember, guys, I have played this before. I played the demo. Um, so I do know a little bit what I'm doing. So let's uh, let's start a new game here. Um, okay, so this is different. I don't remember this in the demo. Realistic. Uh, yeah, I think we'll keep it there. Oh, okay. So... So this game, and the developer knows it, that the, uh, the FPS is just all over the place with this game. It's not, it's not, uh, it's not perfect. The optimization could be better. Um, but, you know, I mean, I think it's a, uh, probably a small studio. Um, I think it's just one guy, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so Nick said, it's not even a studio. It's just like one guy making this game. So we'll, uh, we'll cut him some slack for that. Why not? So... On the map, you can view the task to be completed and get to know the area. It is not used for teleportation. Green pins indicate places that you have already cleared snow. Blue pins indicate areas available for snow removal. Also remember that at any time, you can bring up the world map where you can find more information by pressing the appropriate key. Alrighty. Okay, so if I remember from the demo, the, uh, the notifications get to be a bit of a... A pain in the backside. So what we're gonna do is we need to come over here to the computer uh, online shop. On your computer, you will find software to connect to the online store where you'll be able to buy tools that will allow you to manually clear snow from your property, plows connected to various vehicles, clothes that will keep you warm, and depending on the number of pockets, carry more or less power ups with you. Okay, that's kind of weird that they put that as a different point. Uh, power ups, products that provide you with energy to work, additional equipment or medicine if you get sick. Items become available at various stages of the game. Also remember to manage the budget reasonably. Otherwise, you will soon be out of pocket. Alright, so let's click on the computer. So we need to buy a shovel. Uh, plows. Yeah, we can't buy anything like that. Clothes. Nothing's unlocked yet. Uh, power-ups. Shops and restaurants providing power-ups are open at different hours. That's why the stock in the online store often changes. Okay. So this is where we get our food to uh, keep our nourishment up here. What do we got? 900 calories. Let's buy some bananas. There we go. Uh, spaghetti. Uh, yes, please. Loves me some spaghetti. Um, sushi. I don't think I want to be carrying around sushi in my pocket. You know I mean, that's, that's me. Although, how the hell am I carrying spaghetti in my pocket? I don't know how that works either. Um... Chips are really unhealthy, so you, you kind of want to get healthy stuff. Um, let's let's buy some tomato soup. Okay, there we go. Objects. This is an important one, so we need to buy cough syrup. We need to buy hand cream, but this one is good for 25 below, so we'll buy this one. Uh, yes, we need to buy aspirin. We will. We're gonna actually buy. All of this tea, we're gonna buy coffee, and we're going to buy a thermos as well. And we still have $382 left. Not too shabby. Okay. So now we just have to wait for this stuff to be delivered. And yeah, the, uh, the notifications, they notify you for everything. Uh, in the future, I hope there's a way that you could turn the notifications off because they really get annoying. All right, and here we are. Hub Garage Prologue, description of the job. Clearing snow from the path to the office. You will not earn money on it, but it will allow customers to place orders. Remember to buy the right tool as well. Yeah, so we already did that. <laughs> There's our shovel, shipments to courier, some items purchased in the online store will soon be delivered by courier. You will know that the courier has arrived because he will definitely honk and an appropriate message will appear, blah, blah, blah. Okay, we get that. And we got our thermos beautiful okay so okay <laughs> see what i mean like it, it's just the messages are too much 
Uh, social table. Hot coffee or tea will keep you warm when you get too cold. However, remember to replenish supplies in store. You can also buy a thermos to take a warming drink with you. All information appearing on the screen is remembered and the number next to the icon indicates how many of this interface is saved. You can always enter and see the messages that you missed by clicking the I as usual. Now, the last time I played this on uh, the demo, my god. You can't delete all the messages. You gotta delete them one by one, which is a pain. And if I remember correctly, yeah. Some of these are very difficult to delete because the trash can is hidden. Okay, so let's get that done. Now what we're going to do... Oh my god, see? Now we have more. <laughs> more and more and more. Ridiculous. Okay, oh my gosh. You know what it is? I've already played the demo of this, so it's like I don't need to know all this. So we're going to use the hand cream. That's going to keep our hands nice and healthy. Uh, no frostbite for us. Let's shut the door. There we go. Okay. Let's go out. Shut that door because we're not heating the outside, damn it. We'll press Q. And that shows us the area we have to clear. I mean, standing in the snow clears it. <laughs> but we're going to get out our shovel. Snow removal. Oh, good lord. Okay. Where's is the shovel out? It doesn't look like it. Okay, there we go. Uh, and so basically, we're just gonna shovel the path. We need to clear all the snow that's in the blue area here. This is ridiculous that I'm playing a game about snow removal when I literally live <laughs> in a state that gets snow and I absolutely hate shoveling, but yeah, here I am in the warmth of my own house, playing a game, doing the thing I hate the most. <laughs> uh, you know, honestly, we have not had hardly any snow at all. Uh, gates, wickets, and barriers... All properties you will work on are available only when your work is appreciated by the client. They will recommend you to another person. Entering the area will not be possible until you receive such a recommendation. Okay, so there's a lot more pop-ups this time than there was in the demo, actually. Um, so, okay, let's do this. You know what? Oh my goodness! And yeah, the uh, the frame rates they just they just go really bad. And I mean, again, <laughs> it's not my PC because this game isn't like the best looking game you've ever seen. Um, you know, I would put this probably in the same category as Lawn Mowing Simulator. Uh, it's kind of tedious like that. I did feel in the demo that the shoveling here gets a little tedious. So what we'll probably end up doing is probably time-lapsing a lot of this. Because I don't think you guys want to see me shovel this whole thing. I mean, we will this first one, but uh, I know what's coming next, and what's coming next will uh, we'll definitely time-lapse. But you know, this is kind of the cool thing about PC games, that there's just so many weird, quirky games that are on PC. And, uh, I think I see something flashing in the snow. Ah. Yeah. We will we'll go back and we'll check that out. But like, honestly, this game could easily come to console, right? I mean, <laughs> uh, I think, uh, position 
of the finds. If you don't find in a few minutes, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Yeah, all right. I see it. $500. Someone lost some money. Well, that's a shame. <laughs> so I'm not... Whoops, hit the wrong button there. So I'm not a, uh, a reputable... <laughs> snow removal company. I mean, we just stole someone's money. The, the nice thing to do would have been saved it. I kind of prowled somewhere that, hey, you know, if you drop some money at the shop, well, let me know. Tell me how much you you left. You know, so I know it's you. But instead, <laughs> we were like, nope. Find your keepers. Shouldn't have dropped it. Shouldn't have dropped it. Okay, so. See all those blue spots that we left? <laughs> I know in the demo version of the game you have to clear all of that and that's where the tediousness comes into it maybe they fix that I kind of hope they do because I mean once we get this big section cleared it's good like, it, it's good uh, we're at 90 mm. Okay, so they do want us to get some more of these. Uh, let's possibly go over here and let's clear that out. That's only 99.5%. Yeah, see what I mean? It's like, uh, I feel like this part could be tweaked. They, they want you to get really ridiculous with it. No, obviously, you don't have to, right? You don't have to get it 100%. That's just uh, me being me, I guess. 98.8. Ah, 100%. Nice. Okay, so let's put the shovel away. Press enter. And yes, I do want to hand over the job. Beautiful. That went down to 1 FPS. <laughs> New customers can easily come to your office. Congratulations. There's still snow removal of driveways under the garage gates. Just by a more efficient tool. Okay, so we can we can buy a more efficient tool. Wicket. I can't open that yet. Okay. So yeah, the uh performance of the game, not not spectacular. Weather station, yeah, you can know, see what weather awaits and how the best just to avoid the cold. Oh, that was, okay, that was intense. What's this other light switch? Outdoor light, okay, turn that on. So what does the weather look like here? 21, 22, it just goes by the hour. Can we do anything up here? No, okay. Let's check in with the computer. Ah, so now we can buy the small scraper, which incidentally, this is similar to the, the snow shovel that I use in real life. So we will buy that. Uh, we don't think we need to buy anything else. Plows, clothes. Yeah, we're good on everything else. Uh, one thing I will say. They've done something because... Oh, maybe it's the hand cream? Because my, my temperature isn't going down, which normally would be by now. Normally I'd already be sick. Uh, push tools, a scraper, push and blah, blah, blah. Okay. So we did that. So now what they want us to do is, yeah, they want us to clear all that. So now we're going to press number two here. And with this, we just push it. Wow. FPS is taking a huge hit here. I don't know why. There we go. Let's back it up. Alright guys, so this is probably the part that I'm going to time lapse through because we don't need to see this whole thing.
Alright, so it's telling us that we've wasted calories, but uh, as you can see, the bar up there is we're not really hungry yet. And we found something else in the snow here. I do remember this from the demo. Th this was in the demo. The, uh, the demo ended after this, actually. But where... Where is it? I don't see anything in the snow just yet. <laughs> so I will say, like, uh, one of the strange things about this game, uh, I don't, I don't know where this game is supposed to be located, but all of a sudden the weather will change and it'll start raining and thundering. <laughs> it's just kind of strange. Oh wait, there it is right there. It wasn't glowing though. Okay, so that's the back room key. Okay, so that hasn't changed. That was the same in the demo. Um, as you can see, we're uh, we're doing pretty good, man. We got 75 percent done. This scraper does a hell of a job. It's it really does. And to be honest with you guys, in real life. This thing is a lifesaver uh, and a backsaver when you don't have a snowblower. My uh, my dad he picked up one of these for me. The, the guy lives up the road from he had like ten of them or something. And he was selling them for dirt cheap. My dad picked me up one and man, it was just absolute game changer for shoveling my driveway. I can shovel my driveway so much quicker. probably boring you with the stories of snow removal but I mean <laughs> it's what the game is it's what the game is so that's what we're talking about all right so I think I got all that I think what I have left is up there yeah and where did that come from where did that big pile come from so what we're gonna do is we're gonna change to the uh, the regular shovel here because this just gets rid of the snow the scraper is good for pushing it but uh, we need to just get rid of all this here. So we shall do that. Like I was saying earlier about how, I mean, this game could be on consoles easily, right? I mean, there's really no reason why it couldn't be, aside from the fact that you know, a smaller developer may not want to go through the hassles of putting the game on console. You know, although, I mean, we do have so much shovelware games on console, uh, pun not intended, <laughs> that's literally what it's called. Uh, you know... It's, it's kind of ridiculous. And Sony, they're, uh, I don't know, man, they're just like the biggest protagonist of that. They, they constantly put those shovelware games on their store, and it's so annoying. I would say 95% of the new games on, on Sony's store are just all shovelware. Okay, so let's hit this here. So I know that the developer on Steam, he had said that when it snows out, if you get a lot of snow, this will all be covered back up and this will be a job again. And let's see here, we have that snow over there. 99%, I don't think we're going to get this one 100 because this is just... See, I feel like this needs to be adjusted because that's it. That, and that's preventing us from getting the 100%. It's a little bit much, I feel. I mean, look, this little tiny spot here. You got this little spot over here. That's, uh, that's a bit of overkill. Like, I feel like that should be more than enough. 
that should be more than enough, I think. But like I said, I'm want to be a completionist with it here. And it's hard to even get in there, so I'm just going to make this pass here, and that's it. I think that's what we're going to call this job. See, I cleaned all that up. And it's still only 99.4. Oh man, yeah, there's still some out there. You know what? 99.4%. That's fine. I'm calling it. Yep. I'm not getting paid for this job anyway. Uh, now you'll be able to leave the garage vehicles until the next snow. Congratulations. You can now start your adventure. Talk with your neighbors. You complete all the tasks in the hub. See what you can find in a private room and check what's new to buy in the store. And we have all those. Wow, the FPS just is so unstable on this game. Okay, so we can go to there. Let's take a look and oh, let's close the door first again. Don't want to heat the outside. Uh, clothes. Okay, so we can buy clothes now. We have seven hundred twenty-two dollars, so we can buy. Uh, we can buy this here. Waterproof is three. Breathability is four. Aeration is four. Convenience is three. Uh, reflect the elements, yes. Minimum temperature seven below. Max temperature ten. Eight pockets. Five below. This one's more waterproof. Interesting. Okay, so hmm, I don't know which one to get here. The waterproof is nice, especially when it rains. Uh, this one will keep you warmer. Aeration is better. I'm not sure what aeration means. Convenience. What does convenience mean? I have no idea. Pockets eight. So you can actually wear this when it's warmer as well though. Five bolt negative five. It's above. Let's let's buy this one. Okay, we'll buy that one. We're still going to have power-ups. We haven't taken any of our power-ups. So, let's, uh... Door to the private room. Uh, in the wardrobe, you'll find purchase and available clothes. Choose and wear clothes appropriate to the temperature outside so you won't freeze. Alrighty. Uh, okay, so we have all this here. Artifacts found during the game will appear on this... Board. Yeah, I, mean, I remember that. So this was in the uh, the demo, actually. Artifacts on the board. Yeah, I remember that. We get the keys. That's where they wouldn't let us go any further from that. I had this music on. I have no idea. This is probably going to get <laughs> copyright claimed like crazy. It's uh, it is what it is though. Next. Okay, let's put that on. All right. There we go. Uh, hmm. All right, so calories, we should probably eat something. What was... Yeah, let's, uh, let's have a banana. Wow, that filled us right up. All right. All right. Okay, so. No, no thank you. Don't want to do that again. Garage door. Gate open. Let's open these gates and... I, uh, I turned my graphic settings down. I'm still getting FPS drop. So it's just it's just a game, guys. It's just a game. Uh, pickup. You can drive a pickup truck all over the world. And over time, when you buy a suitable plow, you can clear snow from the roads. 
pickup is equipped with standard WSAD steering and an automatic transmission. As always, pay attention. Reliable features in the left corner. Blah blah blah. Okay, that's what? What in the world is that? Oh, that sound. That sounds horrible. That sounds like bees in a tin can. Holy. Jeez, okay. <laughs> wow. Let's take a look at the map here. What do we got? Tractor. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Okay. Oh, gosh. That's horrible. I do not like steering this way. Um, this game doesn't have any controller support. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I can't imagine plowing like this. Okay. So, I can go down. Wait a minute. Was this right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, there we are. Um, how do I X to get out of the vehicle? Oh, that is rough, man. That does not sound good at all. Where is it over here? Okay. Yeah, because that's the tractor. Mr. and Mrs. Smith, uh, snow thoroughly, snow thoroughly the property. Snow thoroughly the property. Ooh, I'm not gonna lie, I just, I, I thought I was having a stroke there for a second. Snow thoroughly the property, Mrs. and Mr. Smith. That was hard to read. This is the first lucrative job, so take a time, so take a time to work. Oh my gosh, you can find more information by clicking the mailbox. That's, that's definitely words. Uh, you can drive the tractor and clear stone almost anywhere. You can't replace the plow with another one. Which one is efficient enough? As always, pay attention, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So, I think this is our tractor now. And, oh, that's a lot of snow. That's a lot of snow. Holy crap. Uh, okay. So, we may just, we may use this thing. Um, but you know what, guys? I think we're going to do that and next time. Um, I don't want this video to be too long, and I feel like it's uh, been as long as it is. So thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, and uh, yeah, if you did, hit the like button, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and join me for the next video, possibly. Uh, if you guys want to see how this ends, then let me know in the comments, and we can... We can do that, or if not, we can just uh, we can just drop it where it is. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, and we'll see you next time.